Hey everyone, it's Cupquick. Welcome to another episode of Minecraft Oasis, but today is not like any other normal day because it's Sunday, which means BAM! Face cam and a full hour of uncut Minecraft gameplay. So, last where we left off, I hatched a baby wyvern, and we have a wyvern. Um, and I have uh, two more eggs for this wyvern. Um, a sandstorm or a sandstorm. <laughs> booka booka boo. A sand wyvern and a jungle wyvern. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna connect the wyvern cages up top um, just so that they can roam around freely. Um, another thing that I wanted to do was I really wanted to, I've been wanting to make some jewelry um, like for the, for the RPG inventory. And I found out how to do it. So like this necklace, this ring, these, um, <clears throat> I think the gloves. I don't know if you have to do that, but you need like a What's it called a for a forge a mold forge for that? So um, I'm gonna need some clay and a lot of it and I think I need some obsidian as well um, I think I use all wait do I have obsidian <clears throat> Where is do I have any clay? I'm probably gonna have to go out and get some but no we won't because we have some right here That's a lot. Okay, cool so, we're gonna have to make the clay blocks. No, we're gonna have to make these into clay bricks. Um, so we're gonna put them in the furnace. I don't know exactly how many I need, but you know what? I'm gonna need to make the the clay blocks, like the, <clears throat> like not the clay blocks, the, um, the brick blocks. And I'm gonna have to make to put those around one piece of obsidian. So I don't know exactly how many that comes out to, but let's just try that. And I guess while those are in the oven, I can go work on the wyverns cage. I'm gonna expand it. I'm really excited. I'm gonna get all the wyverns. I'm gonna have them all um, in the same little area because um, I want them to be able to like roam around freely. And I think it'd be cool like if I kind of expand it all around up into where the cemetery area is because there's nothing over here um i just think it would look so cool to have like wyverns just hanging out there so i'm gonna need to get rid of this tree <clears throat> and i'm gonna need to let's go ahead and get rid of these bushes or shrubs right here um okay so i'm gonna just go ahead and start working on this because i'm like super excited for this i really i think i'm gonna make like I don't, I, okay, I'm trying to think. Where would the entrance be? So I'm gonna be here on the platform. I guess I can move the entrance to here and it can be all along right here. So let me just go ahead and place all of these wood pieces down. I hope you guys are having an awesome Sunday. I am, um, I'm actually filming this on Sunday. I usually try to film it the day before, but um, I f filmed, uh, Red and I filmed film Cloud Nine the day before, and <clears throat> usually one episode of Oasis. I mean, it's crazy. I never thought about this. Super Oasis, especially, uh, takes since it's an hour long. In order for everything to be completely done um, and uploaded, it takes about five hours. Isn't that crazy? So it's like one hour of filming, um, one hour of uh, <clears throat> or like thirty minutes. I have to put my, um, you know what? I'm gonna make this a tree. I'm gonna make this uh, uh, a wyvern tree. One of the trees that were at their layers. Ooh, that's gonna be cool. And that's gonna be inside of their home. Um, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like still a little sick. So I'm gonna be clearing my throat. Um, but yeah, I didn't realize it took five hours to do one episode of Oasis because we got to process my webcam because for some reason when I bring it into Premiere, the, the audio is out of sync. So that's an extra 30 to 40 minutes. Then after that, um, I have to bring in an edit and that takes about 30 minutes. 
and then the exporting takes into about another hour and then the uploading takes about an hour but the thing with cloud nine cloud nine takes six hours plus it's a lot of waiting around it's not like i'm sitting by the computer all of those um <clears throat> those hours but man i didn't realize that uh cloud nine would take so long because we have two instead of just one recording and one uh webcam there's two so that's it was crazy i i spent all day um well i woke up at seven i never wake up at seven on saturday and uh we recorded it at seven in the morning uh and then we had a plan to go to um the beach with our friends like as a last kind of summer hurrah type thing and um so yeah we had to wake up really early and it took six hours so it was crazy and i didn't have time to film oasis then so i was just like i'll just wake up early again and that didn't happen since i spent the whole day at the beach afterwards i was so drained just from like the sun and that's all of the wyvern stuff that i have dang it i'm gonna have to go back we're gonna have to gather all this so um in the previous episode i do post up um, and I hope you guys enjoy that I do this. Uh, I post up fan art um, <clears throat> Just to show you know my appreciation that I do I, I used to get fan art just all the time And I kind of made it a thing now in Oasis to put fan art um, At the end of each episode um, Just to give you guys like you know a little appreciation and I ask for the fan art on uh, on Facebook so anyone could submit the pictures to Facebook, um, but I do kind of moderate them. So like if you put something that's irrelevant, I will just get it off. Um, but it's kind of like your honor system. Like there's no way of me telling if you really did uh, draw something um, <clears throat> Or, you know, sometimes I do see repeats of people trying to claim, you know, other people's artwork. And uh, I try to do my best to try and, like, weed out the fake people from, you know, the real artists. Because I know that, like, since I am an artist myself, plagiarism is, like, one of the world. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> no! No! Plagiarism creeper! Plagiarism creeper had something to say and he was just like What? Plagiarism? Get No! No! Get out of my house! Oh no! Oh, where's my husband? Why can't my husband help me kill him? Oh my gosh. I'm just dying left and right here. Plagiarism creeper coming into troll. Uh, anyways, like I was saying, um, yeah, like I try to do my best to, uh, weed out like the real from the fake and, but sometimes like there's no way of me telling and usually it's just kind of based off if I've seen like a repeat before multiple times, um, then that's when I'll, you know, kind of be like, wait a minute, this doesn't seem like it's the real person. So, um, something on the previous episode, terrible happened. Um, I always like to give credit to the artists. And um, so <clears throat> the the uh, artwork from the previous episode at the ending, um, someone had submitted that <clears throat> and I had never seen it before. And um, they plagiarized and it wasn't their artwork. So in the previous episode, I gave credit to Rainbow Kitty um, when it was supposed to go to Viva La Lama and she has a DVR and I felt so bad because I seen her, <clears throat> I seen some messages on, um, like on the Facebook group. Um, I seen people posting the picture again and saying like, this isn't her artwork. This isn't, uh, Rainbow Kitty's artwork. Viva La Lama did it. Go check out her DVR. art. And I went to her DVR. art. <clears throat> and I felt so bad because it was, it was true. And, um, I try to like, you know, avoid things like this. And I felt super bad because she made a post too saying how she felt terrible because she'd been like plagiarized or whatever. And I just felt so bad. I tweeted her 
th there's nothing that I can do about that episode now because it's already up and it's when I edit the videos like that's already in the video when it exports so there's nothing that I can do but I did put uh, annotation over it giving credit to the real artist and um, in the description I say that you know the real artist is this and I'll credit her in the next video which I'm doing right now so I'm gonna go ahead and put Viva La Llama I'm gonna put her um, <clears throat> DeviantArt in the description so you guys can go check her out she has really good artwork and she does artwork for other youtubers as well so I've seen stuff for <clears throat> for Nova she's done an, another one for Oasis and I've actually put it up and um, given her the right credit for it um, so <clears throat> I'm gonna just put her artwork up on the screen right now and give her credit um, because that is just a terrible terrible feeling you know when you work so hard on something and then someone just comes in and claims it as their own it's so terrible so and I feel bad because it, like it has something to do with what I did too because I should I I seen the signature on the bottom of it but I never, you know, I didn't know this this other person. Oh wow, she's getting big. Hi, Starbucks. So there was no way of me really knowing um, if this was the real person. So I hope she accepts my apology, and um, you know, I'm gonna try a little better to. Um, I mean, I, I there's it's, there's really no way of me telling, um, but. <clears throat> I'm gonna try to do better. I think I may just look for the stuff on Deviant Art. So if you guys do do artwork, I would really suggest making a Deviant Art account. I have one, and I just have not, I have not <laughs> posted. It is so old. I have not posted a new piece of art in like years, um, which I was talking to Red about. And um, actually, we uh, came up with we're, we were launching a. This is exciting. I totally forgot about this. Today, um, we're launching a new store, a new merch store. And um, this is a really big tree. <laughs> you know what? I feel like, I feel like maybe I should, I don't know. I don't know what I should do. That's a, just a humongous tree. <laughs> um, I'll figure that out later. I'm gonna start putting some glass down. But <clears throat> today, we are actually launching a new merch store, which is exciting because I have not been keeping up with my merchandise um, forever. Like I haven't posted a new one, uh, a new clothing design in a long while. And um, you know, it was something that I wanted to keep up with, but I just, just got so busy. But now that Red is here home um, helping me, um, he can actually help me do some designs and we've collaborated <clears throat> on a couple designs and um, We're launching a new merch store today, and it's from merch addict. It's no longer on spreadshirt So if you have ordered something from spreadshirt, you're still gonna get it because I've been seeing a lot of orders recently uh, but uh, after I'm just gonna close it down and we're going to just have some new designs on this new um on our new store so I'm gonna put a link in the description for that as well and you guys can check out there's two well there's one new design and there's oh man did I mess up with the oh well we'll keep that pretty we'll, we'll put these bushes on the inside so they're not like teased um, so there's 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 the logo the it's the same logo the eyes cupcake logo <clears throat> but red has um, kind of reworked it for me so it looks a lot nicer and cleaner. I like this. Um, and there is another one that Red and I worked on together. Um, I actually drew it and he vectorized it. So it is a, I'm gonna put it on the screen for you guys right now. So it's just a, it's pretty feminine, but don't worry, we're going to come up with some masculine designs as well. This is why I have Red helping me because I will go too crazy if it's like, you know, Cupquake is kind of like a feminine girly name, so it's kind of hard to steer clear of that. But Red's gonna do his best to try to help me with that. And um, I'm gonna go check on my clay. I'm gonna have to get some more glass because this is, this is a lot. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna put the link in the description. You guys can go check out the shirts. 
and purchase one if you like. We have kids sizes there as well. And um, we are going to be coming out with some new t-shirt designs. Um, hello, honey. <clears throat> Let me chat with, oh, what? Weird. What? Oh my gosh, I can't talk to him. <sighs> I can't talk to him. I can't, why can't I talk to him? I don't want to hit him. Oh my gosh, this is so bugged. <coughs> I can't talk to my husband. I'm sorry. Anyways, oh, poor David, he's going to hate me. Well, can I talk to my, this is my son. I can talk to my son. Joke. Okay, well, <clears throat> anyways, I can, um, I'm gonna put the link in the description uh, to the new store and I'm also gonna put that on my YouTube page so that um, there's no confusion. Don't go to the Spreadshirt one anymore. Those designs are going to be taken down. Um, I think I have enough. Let's see. Um, I think that's enough. Okay, let's just grab all of those. I'm gonna grab my block of obsidian. Oh, I still have more, hey pig. Where did the scorpion go? Is it still in my house? Um, yeah, I'm super excited about it. And we're gonna be coming out with some new designs um, as often as we can. Probably like one, maybe two a month, I think would be doable. I hope this is enough. Did I make enough? <laughs> yeah, mold forge. Okay, so we got that mold forge down. Um, <clears throat> but I'm really excited. And, um, if you guys are going to PAX, if you missed the piece of Quake, um, I'm going to be actually Merch Addict, it's Merch Addict who we're going through, is going to give us five shirts of each design and I'm going to take them with me to PAX. And, uh, if I see, you know, if I still have them and I see someone there at PAX that's a fan, um, I will sign it and give it to you guys. So, um, I'm really excited. Um, I'm just excited to just kind of be doing something a little bit like different, focusing a little more on something else besides just doing videos, 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 because it can be so tiring <clears throat> and, it, and you can get just like stuck in the cycle of making videos, making videos, making videos. And it's just, it's crazy. Um, but yeah, um, two things you need to check in the description. Uh, Viva La Llama, you need to go check her out and um, the Merch Attic store. Um, so yeah, and shame on Rainbow Kitty. That makes me so sad that, I mean, I've seen it multiple times, like people plagiarizing, but that's like one of the, the worst feelings. Like you work so hard on something and um, I'm gonna put this away. Um, you don't get credit for it and someone just takes it from you like that. So <clears throat> anyways, we got this mold forge down. I think I'm gonna need some, you know what? I wish I could ch change the gold from the golden apple into real gold. <gasps> My triceratops is hungry. Where are they eating? There's a ton of fern down there. How much gold do I have? <coughs> Let's see. Um, I'm going to need a gold block, I think, for the mold. But we do need to feed the Triceratops. Let's go up and I should make him a... Let's make him a feeder. Wait, here. Wait, what is it? Feet? Berserker feet. Okay, let's make him a feeder, which is stone, a button, iron, and a... Do I have glass? No, I don't. Hmm... Um, I'm gonna have to go out and grab some more sand. Let's go out on our, um, let's go out on our Pegasus. And I'm going to fly and grab some. No, Triceratops, I know you're hungry. Hold on, let's just uh, take care of this farm. <gasps> Whoa, Crow, Mr. Crow. Oh, it's Choco, Choco Crow. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, Speaking of art, there's just like so much going on and so much that's happening. Um, well, first off, like one of the big noticeable thing that that's happening and um, is insane is that uh, my channel is reaching a million subscribers. 
that is some cray cray stuff like I I don't know I mean I don't want to say anything really too much yet because I'm, I'm planning on making a special video for you guys but it's just happening so fast and I'm just like uh, I need time to plan I need time to plan like what am I gonna do oh my god I'm so unprepared for this and it's just something that's like so surreal and unreal and it's just like I've been doing this for almost three years and it's just like my hard work is finally showing and it's a lot of work. Um, I know anyone out there who does do YouTube kind of full time will tell you it is not something easy. It is just, I mean it is fun, but it's a lot, a lot, a lot of work. And it can be kind of stressful sometimes. Um, <clears throat> okay, let's go down and feed my Triceratops. I wish I could have made a feeder, but I don't have any glass. So we're gonna go ride, let's go ride one of my horses down. And I need to put some more bird things in there. Oh, and I do need to put the water up there. That's terrible. Um, but, um, yeah, I, it's, it's crazy, it's crazy. And it's happening really fast. I think it's supposed to happen. I was looking at vid stats to see like, when am I gonna hit it? Cause I need to prepare this video and, um, it says, I think it's supposed to happen like in 10 or 15 days, which is stupid. That's crazy. I I think I have like 40,000 subscribers left. Okay, where the heck? Which Triceratops is hungry? Which one of you is hungry? Let me just feed you some wheat. Oh, I only have one. What happened to the other one? Here you go. Eat, 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 eat. You're eating. Are you full yet? There you go, okay. This really sucks. I don't know why it's not eating the ferns. Are the ferns not good enough for you? Are they not good enough for you? Oh, there's two of them in there. <laughs> I was like, I could have sworn I had two Triceratops. Anybody else hungry? They're just inside of each other. <laughs> there as one. Okay, let's go grab some sand really quick. Where you going, sugar lumps? Come back, sugar lumps. My lovely lady lumps. Okay. <clears throat> I'm just gonna gather some sand right here. Um, but yeah, so that's coming up. Um, I'm working on some side stuff that is also exciting, kind of off, off of YouTube as well. Um, Cause I think there'd be like, I don't know. It's like YouTube, doing YouTube is kind of scary because you never know when it's gonna end. You never know when it's like gonna stop going good for you and you're just gonna not be relevant anymore. It's, it's, it's like, it's not a good like business platform. It's a good starter to start you off and do what you wanna do to help, you know, get you going, get some subscribers and then take it from there. I'm not saying I'm stopping YouTube, but I'm, I'm, I don't know when it, you know, people ask me when, you know, where will you be in five years? Will you still be doing YouTube? I'm like, I hope so. Like, I hope it's still going really good for me. I know that this like new media platform is just still kind of, it's still, still really new and people are still barely finding out about it. And it's just crazy to some people. Like I was talking to, um, my husband Red. I was talking to his cousin this weekend and we haven't, we haven't seen her in a while and she doesn't really know what I do. And I was kind of trying to explain it to her and she was just like, well, how, what, like, how does this work? How you make a YouTube channel? And it was just like, so many people don't know about it. And it's just insane. And all right, I'm all full. We need to go. We need to go. It's turning nighttime anyways. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, like it's kind of, it's kind of scary. And I, I'm sure that any YouTuber feels like this too. Like, you know, when something so good is going for you, you're just like, okay, well, when, when is it gonna, when is it gonna end? Cause all good things have to come to an end. Right. And it's just kind of like, it's kind of a gamble. Like, so this is why I'm trying to, you know, kind of establish, you know, a little like clothing brand or something off of YouTube or something. And I've been working, I don't want to say too much about it, but I've been working, um, with another company, um, to get some, I guess, tangible things for you guys. <clears throat> and it's really exciting because it's, it's like, 
it's still kind of in my field and it's like art related and design related and it's super fun. Um, but that's all I'm going to say about it. Um, but what am I doing? I'm putting glass in the furnace because <clears throat> we need, or we're putting sand in the furnace because I need some glass. Um, but, um, and like besides the stuff I'm doing off of YouTube too, I decided that I want to, I really, really want to start bringing <clears throat> art back to my channel. It was after I seen, you know, um, uh, Viva La Llama's channel or, uh, Deviant Art. And I went onto my Deviant Art and I was like, why did I stop? Like, why did I stop doing art? <clears throat> this is this is what I went to school with for this is what I went to school for this is you know what makes me happy I should really bring it back to my channel and I know that a lot of you guys subscribed earlier on during like the art of gaming series when I you know would have have an art series and um actually like do speed art stuff and I and I really kind of want to bring it back one because I don't want to lose you know any <clears throat> any schooling or skill that I have and two because it really does make me happy and it really does like it's so cool to to you know when, so once you're done working on something for like six hours just be like I worked on this and I created this so that's you know something that I want to do oh my gosh <gasps> what is this okay <clears throat> we're gonna figure this out so um, we're supposed to put gold blocks. So let's make a gold block. We have enough gold, right? Is it like that? No. Oh, there's a lot of gold. One gold block. <laughs> and we need to fuel it. <clears throat> um, and it said that, it said that it takes a lot, a lot, a lot of fuel. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a bucket. We're going to get a bucket. Where's Mr. Bucket? Oh no. No! Oh, thank God. I thought it was gonna, I thought it was gonna break. Where's Mr. Bucket? <clears throat> Where is my Mr. Bucket? Where the heck is he? I have no idea. Do I have not have Mr. Bucket? I'll put this away. Put that away. Oh, why doesn't it go in there? I think I may have to make another Mr. Bucket. May, he may be upstairs. Let's go check and see. Is it down here? Well, we have iron there too, so we can make one if we need to. <clears throat> Let me check upstairs. You know what? I totally have to keep track of time because I have, I didn't press the timer. I usually have a timer that um, starts to kind of tell me that I'm um, close to, close to an hour. But is this armor, is that armor for horses? Or is that for wyverns? You know what I'm gonna do? Let's just, I wanna make like a little water thing here. <clears throat> How do you make one of those things? They're like a cauldron, cauldron, here it is. Oh, I need a lot of iron. Well, I really don't like cauldrons because they do run out of water. I wish that like, I mean, I wanna make one just for looks. Because I think it makes it look, like, super cool. Um, to have something that's, like, not an endless water pit. But I feel like the cauldron should be endless water. I feel like you shouldn't have to refill it. Because it's, like, such a, supposed to be such a big thing of water, you know? There we go. Okay, so we have a bucket for lava. And I'm gonna go... Let's go sleep first. Let's go to sleep. So we're gonna sleep. And, um... <clears throat> go down get some lava. We're gonna try to make this mold and Hopefully I'm not uh, I'm gonna have to like alt tab out hold on the recordings gonna stop for one second I totally have to, I just don't even know what time I started doing this and I lost track of time so bad Okay, we're good on time um, Sorry about that. I usually am really good about that, but um For some reason I was just like super excited to play today <laughs> um, I need to go let's go down to our mining area and I know I have a ton ton of lava down there so we should be we should be cool with that um I kind of want ooh fish egg let's go grab that yeah we got a new fish we got a new fish for my ooh we're gonna put it in our koi fish pond 
because I haven't still haven't added fish down there and I totally forgot about all those flowers um, <clears throat> but let's go down and just grab some lava really quickly I kind of wanted to make like an endless lava pit but that's okay I've died so many times like in the previous episodes I was like before before I actually got like the RPG um, what is it the RPG uh, inventory armor I hadn't died once and then when I killed myself the first time and it's just this armor is just so low armor like the damage is really good but the armor is terrible all right so we gotta go we gotta go down 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 deep yeah uh, uh, I don't even know where this is I feel like okay wait a minute there's an easier way to get down to where the lava is and we are just taking the hard way um but yeah, I am going to, like I was saying, I'm gonna start, um, well, I was discussing with Mario some like t-shirt designs that could be some possibilities. And then I was thinking to myself like, <clears throat> remember when I used to live stream me doing artwork like for the art of gaming? I did it a couple times, but then I got in trouble uh, with Machinima because since it was going to be a series that goes up on their channel, I couldn't like, I couldn't do a live stream of it, but I'm not doing this series anymore. So I was thinking maybe to keep me, you know, up with art or, you know, maybe I could do a live stream when I just like draw or something and we just, we just hang out or instead of, <clears throat> instead of that, maybe we can do, um, like a speed art and I could just record it and bring back, you know, something similar to the art of gaming, <clears throat> but it wouldn't be like game related. It'd just be the thing. Oh, geez. Ooh, what's down here? Oh, oh, scary, scary. You know what? I really want to find that diamond. I want to find that diamond. Where are you? I hear something really scary. Uh -huh. I hate these noises down here. Huh? Oh, it's a zombie. It's just a zombie. Don't worry. <clears throat> I'm going to eat this. We are going to, like, die uh, really soon if we get hit because our armor is, like, Super low. Where is it? I'm listening. It's getting higher, so maybe it's down here. Huh? Okay, it has to be over here somewhere. But there's lava right there, so we gotta be careful. I think I did come down here and try to find it. Are we getting closer, Navi? Are we getting closer? No, we're getting further, so it's this way. Oh, hey, gold. Oh, no, the gold. Where'd that zombie go? Dang it. I want to put that there. I hear the zombie. Ah! That's scary. Oh, 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 oh. oh, my God. I could have come crumbling on us. Oh, my gosh. Okay, can I take this lava? I want to take it. Get out of there. There you go. There you go. Put it down. No. No, I need to put this down. Huh, just cover it. That is gonna go away when I get this. What if we get rid of that? No, oh God. No, the gold is gonna get eaten by the lava. What if we dig all the way around it? What if the lava, it, or what if it's, where's my shovel? Ah, I put my shovel away, dang it. What if it's over here? It can be. No, she sounds like she's getting lower. There, we can place that right there. Um, I'm still, it's still gonna fall in the lava. No, oh, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's put that down right there. Can I grab this? She's still really like, oh, yes. <gasps> oh, scary. No, oh, yes, we got it. We got that lava. Okay, she's... The gold or the diamonds around here somewhere. Look! 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 No! We gotta be really careful. It is. It's got to be around here. Where is it? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh! I just got rid of a bunch of lava. That's good. Where the heck? Oh no! Where's the diamond? Where is the diamond? It has to be around here. There's like a friggin' pit of lava right above me. <clears throat> I think it's this way. What if we... 
Huh? Is it over here? I'm kind of uneasy with a bunch of lava on top of me. Well, there's iron. What is down here? Ooh. Ah! No, it's totally over here somewhere. This is gonna drive me crazy. I need to find diamond because I have been giving away uh, and trading some diamonds. So I'm gonna like try. Oh, yay! Oh, oh, get away, get away. Ah, oh, yes, yes. We got one! Woohoo! We got some more diamond! What? There's still more? What? Oh my gosh! Okay. Yay! We got more diamond! Awesome! I love you, Nobby! <clears throat> um, and I got my lava already, so we can already go back. Uh, how did I get out? How do we get out of here? Um... Whoa, how do I get out? I think I went this way. Right? Was it this way? Here we go. Okay. No, I'm not searching for another diamond. We already got that. Um, okay. Anyways, yeah. So I was thinking of doing like some sort of, you know, artistic thing. I still, you know, <clears throat> this is a gaming channel, but I don't know if it would be anything game related because I noticed that when I would do the art of gaming, um, and I would have, you know, people choose what they wanted me to draw. That wasn't like as fun as it normally is because I can't really, I mean, I can be creative and it kind of is like a challenge, but, um, if I wanted to draw something, like I can't just draw something and be completely creative and have complete creative freedom over it. So I think what I'm going to do is when I do do some t-shirt designs, <clears throat> I will, Probably not live stream because I know when I did live stream a couple times I got distracted by the stream and I wasn't like as fast as I as I could draw like I wasn't I wasn't um, I guess What's the word I'm looking for not accurate, but I Can't think of the word um, but Anyways, I, I think I'll still like record it and make a video and put some music to it because it's been such a long time since I've done that on my channel. And then I was thinking, since I'm going to do it digitally, wouldn't it be cool if I could put, you know, if I could make it for um, like whatever I draw. Some people I know can't afford t-shirts. So <clears throat> why not just have, you know, a gift and make it like a desktop? So that's a possibility. We have our level book it. And let us actually go and put, we're gonna put some fuel in here. So we are getting this forge going. So here's the fuel, <clears throat> lava bucket, and here's our gold. And I think I need a diamond. So we need a diamond. Um, process started, coal is already used. Uh, okay, I'm kind of nervous about this because I don't want to mess up. I've never done this before. And I can't scroll down on this is this is all I can see. So hopefully we can figure this out. So let's put one gold or one diamond, <clears throat> and then we need to put a mold right here. So we're almost prepared. We're almost ready, but we need a mold. How do I get a mold? Ah, I can check right here. I have the page up, but the screen. You know what? I'm just gonna like alt tab out so I can. I'm gonna play on a uh, window mode so that I can actually scroll down. Um, so the recording's gonna stop again and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I looked and looked and I just have no idea how to get the dang mold. Um, if you guys know how, um, I would really appreciate if you guys let me know how to do that. Um, I don't wanna give it to myself, but there is no like, crafting for this. I just want to see how it looks. How are you supposed to get that? No idea. <clears throat> Anyways, we'll worry about that later. We're almost like, we almost got it. We just need the mold and then uh, we will be able to craft some jewelry. Um, but let's see. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and sleep. And you know what I do need to keep up with is I still need to keep up with feeding my cows and mating them and breeding them. Um, <clears throat> cause I still want to make all of the other armor. So I have, I want to make the necromancer and the, ro there's rogue armor. I still need to make, I still need to get a, um, I still need to get, um, 
a pet for the beast master, <clears throat> I think. Um, so I'm just gonna keep up with my farm because I don't have very much wheat and I think I may have just given, I need to keep my wheat too for our dinosaurs because they're really picky now and they don't want to eat our, uh, what am I supposed to feed the wyvern? What does he eat? It doesn't say either. Are you, I'm, I'm sure he's hungry. Maybe I can give him seeds. Let's go check on him. Or her. Let's go check on Starburst and see how she's doing. I bet you she's outgrowing her cage. Um, <clears throat> I should probably just collect a bunch of glass so that I can expand this already. Let's look. Oh, she's already getting really big. This cage is so small for her. Starburst. Hello. Oh my gosh, she's so big. Okay. Definitely, I'm gonna do that today. Um, I'm gonna go grab some more glass. I'm gonna just, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to collect a ton of sound. Hopefully we'll have enough um, coal. I should have got like a lava thing so I can make a lava pit up here, but let's put this, oh, you missed me. I can't even talk to my husband. How sad is that? Let's go, let's go mate some horses or cows. I always call them horses. <clears throat> But yeah, I'm planning on doing some artistic stuff um, on the channel, bringing it back. And um, since I know a lot of you guys, uh, you know, don't have jobs, are still young, can't afford, you know, t-shirts, um, I think I'm going to do like some special desktops uh, available for you guys um, for free. Um, so let's see, you two are going to die because you escaped. Yes, I know. I know. Where did Edwin go? There he is. <clears throat> and we still have our ostrich that we have to... I think I have to make armor for them, too. Or I could put, like, a cotton... a wool on them. Okay, who's hungry? Who wants to mate? Breed. There we go. I'm all out. I'm all out of wheat. Now. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna take a look. I know I've looked at it before, but... Oh, you know what? I think I need a sheer sheep, too. We have a lot of string. I know one of the, um, one of the RPG inventory classes requires a lot of string. Let's see what they are. <clears throat> Let's get rid of this. So we already have, let me just double check what I have already. We, I, I can make this wizard, actually. I can make it into, I forgot what it's called. Um... No, it's not a wizard. Why do I keep calling it wizard? Ah, mage. Um, I can put some gold ingots around it, and it can become a different type of armor. Mm, where's all the armor? See, this one right here, an arc mage. Um, <clears throat> but I don't know exactly what they do. I think they're the ones who use, like, the fire staff, the frost staff, the earth staff. Which reminds me, I need to enchant something. I need to enchant my pickaxe with a soft touch in order to mine the ice, um, the grass blocks. I don't even know how to do that though. How do I, how, I know how to enchant, but how do I, I know it's a level 30 enchant and I'm not level 30. So I gotta like really not die anymore. Okay, so for the rogue leather, we need string and purple dye. I'm gonna need a lot of purple dye. So let's figure out how are we gonna get all of this purple dye? I do have, you know, some flowers down here that I should probably be keeping up with. Um, I don't know if I have purple flowers. I don't know if any of these flowers. I think I'm supposed to make the purple dye with the, what is it, with <clears throat> red and um, blue. Whoa, why are these different colors? <gasps> That's so weird. Whoa, that's crazy. Okay, well, we're taking care of our flower garden. Okay. How pretty! Look at all the flowers! Um, <clears throat> so I think I do make, I think I am supposed to make purple dye. I don't think I can get it from this. Let's just check. We might be able to. Purple violets. <gasps> we can! Yes! Oh, yes! Okay, so I'm gonna have to farm these purple violets like crazy. How else can I get purples? Mmm. I can mix red and lapis to make purple, right? It does make purple. I know. 
I know my colors. Um, <clears throat> so we need four purple dyes for just one for one thing. We can make we can make one. Let's just test it. Oh, oh. Let's just test it out. <clears throat> so the dyes are on all corners. And then we can make I think we can make two of them. Leather in the center and then surrounded by string. That is super expensive. We're going to do it though. I have to do it. I have to get The rogue is like my class. I was a rogue in World of Warcraft. Um, that was my first class and I was addicted. <laughs> and I loved her and I just love being so stealthy and it's awesome. Let me see what we need to do. Okay, so we have some glass already. So we can go upgrade our uh, Wyvern <clears throat> um, place just a little bit. Let me just do that, just so I can put all these glasses down, see how much exactly we need. Um, and then I need to make the tree. Before I open it up to Starburst, we need to put a tree in there. And I'm probably going to have to go back. But if we do go back, then I'm going to um, try to get another wyvern. Look at how big she is. Starburst! You're so pretty! Oh my gosh, she's getting so freaking huge. I don't even think she'll be able to walk through this little... I may have to expand this. You know what we can do? <clears throat> Instead of having... We can have like a roof over this. And we can move the stairs. Like we'll move the stairs to come up like this. So right when you'll be up here. And then I can move this out. Maybe we can move this whole thing out. That would be ideal. Um, where is... Let's just remodel that right now really quick. Um, so that we can figure out she because she won't be able to fit through that so let's see <clears throat> we can put the stairs why do I have brown wool what did I kill let's put the stairs right here so let's see it needs to be all the way up so we're going to have the stairs like this um, it's gonna be a bit crooked. I want the stairs to come up like right here, so we'll have the stairs here, and then let's put this down a bit. <clears throat> okay. Oh wait, no, I totally messed up. Did I? I did. Let's get rid of that. No, why? Why? There. Awesome. And then we're gonna put. I'm gonna put um, this here for now. Right now, we're gonna expand this out a little bit, and then I'm just gonna put this down for now. But we will change that, and <clears throat> let's complete the stairs. Awesome! That looks a lot better. Sweet. So we have stairs, and then right when we come up here, we're gonna put the door about here so that she can actually <clears throat> have room. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. I should probably make like an area where <sighs> they can actually fit through because she's not gonna be able to fit through this. It's way too, it's way too little for her. So, hmm. Maybe we can make the exit area over there somewhere. Let's do that. So this is gonna be my little entrance area. And I like having, let's go back and get, let's go back and get our, um, those types of leaves from the wyvern. Cause I like having a bit of color around the door. So <clears throat> let's go grab those. I'm just gonna work on this for a little bit more, but I hope you guys um, really like the idea of doing more art. Armando. Oh, you're not my best friend. Where are you, Armando? I've not been keeping up with my family. Is he looking at Easter? Hello, Andrew. We have such a terrible relationship right now. Our hearts are going down so much. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> Let's go back up. And I'm going to place this down. And I'm really excited to hatch our other wyverns. I should actually... Let's... I don't know if she's full grown. I think you can only put the armor on when they're full grown. Where am I going? Where am I going? Wyvern Lair is up here. I really want to decorate this area too with um, the pretty 
pretty wood. I'm gonna have to go back in there and give myself some. So, this is where the door will be <clears throat> for me. And then, um, all of this will be cleared out. This is not gonna exist. Just wasting some glass. It's okay. <clears throat> and then we'll have... That'll be glass. And I'm gonna have to get rid of this tree. So, and then it'll be expanded back like this. I don't know if she will fly away. Do we actually need a roof on top of this right now? Will she fly away? She hasn't tried to fly any... She hasn't tried to fly anywhere as of yet. But who knows? Um, let me connect that. Awesome. So we're gonna make it pretty high. And then I'm gonna have their exit <clears throat> on that side, just because it's more open. Um, so I'm gonna just go around, place down a bunch of glass. I'm gonna have to collect a ton more because it has to be really tall because I'm gonna put all of them in here. All of them are gonna just be able to chill inside here. And I think I may just put the wyvern um, leaves on the outside just so they have more room to roam around. Okay, we're definitely gonna have to get some glass. <clears throat> and I have to chop down that tree. Look at all my, all my animals. Oh my gosh. It looks so cool from up here. Um, <clears throat> okay, so this is going to... Uh, I don't know if we're gonna... We can just leave this how it is. And just make it like that. Cool. I don't think she's gonna fly away. Part of me is telling me she's not gonna try to fly away. She's mine anyways, right? She's tame. <clears throat> this way let's see we're gonna make it this high is that high enough for her i don't know if it is she's gonna be the biggest one out of all of them so i think i may just oh that was close i think i may have to just put like a wyvern tree here we just got it we got to i don't like the vines anyways <clears throat> i'm definitely gonna have to go back in though we'll make a little trip trip out of it um and I, I don't want to get more wyverns. We already have, I think, almost all of the types of wyverns. But maybe I do because we can we can give the wyverns different essences. Essence of light, darkness, and we can have different types of wyverns. So maybe I should maybe I should go out <clears throat> right now. You know what? I don't think she's gonna fly away. I feel really bad that she's cooped up in here. Let's free her. Let's free Starburst. Oh, I don't want to free her yet because she's just, she may fly away and I'm going to be scared. We'll just leave her in there for now in this tiny little cage. Um, <clears throat> and I'm going to do, before we end this episode, I'm going to go out and we're going to try to kill some enemies. We're going to try to get our XP so that I can actually, um, so that I can... <clears throat> enchants um, with a soft touch so we can get different different types of material so hopefully there is no werewolves out here because I don't like them um, there's our triceratops and stegosaurus I'm just really confused to why they don't eat the ferns <clears throat> that made life so much easier it made it so much easier to have you know um, dinosaurs all right so, I, by the way, just love this bow and arrow. So I'm looking for, I'm look, oh my god, that was a one-shot kill. I'm looking for um, some horse uh, so I can get their hearts, their essences. So let's grab that. Spiders are one-shot kill. That is insane. You're gonna die. And I'm getting, I'm getting good XP. <clears throat> this is good because I need it because I freaking died so many times. Um, where are all of the horses at? Where are they at? I want to kill them. <clears throat> There's werewolves. Do I have enough? I have a little bit of inventory space. So, oh, there's some horses over there. Let's just do this attack on them. On both of them over there. Hopefully they don't move. So it's a P. P is the attack. Here we go. Not coming on me. Yeah! Oh, we got some slime. Awesome. Let's kill some slime. These little guys are hard to kill because they just move so much. Okay. Wow. This is a lot of slime. Get. 
Get back. Get back. I don't want to waste my bow and arrow on you guys. We'll just use my sword. Look at all of that slime that I just got. Holy crap. And all of that experience. I just leveled. The spider's going to die. Level to level 10. Perfect. Oh, and there's a ghost over here. You're going to die, flame and wrath. Wraith. Whatever you want to call yourself. Okay. So no one, none of them. What is he doing up here? Fire ogre? Oh, wow. I cannot believe I hit him. Um. Oh, my gosh. He's attacking us now. Get out of here. And there's an enderman. <gasps> I'm going to do this. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Uh. Ooh, stay there. Stay there. Stay there. Where'd it go? No. Oh, jeez. Oh, they're both coming after me. I did my pee attack and they didn't want to. How come he's not on fire? Oh my gosh, I'm not hitting him. I cannot hit him. I cannot hit him. Don't die. Don't die. We got this. We got this. Don't die. Just go in the water and they'll disappear. They don't like water. Right? They will never teleport in water. My pee attack didn't work on them. What? There was two Endermen. What are the odds of that? Oh, they're over there. Let's try the pee attack again. Let's try it on. I can't look at them because then what if I just look at their feet and press P? Let's look at their feet. Oh, geez. Okay. Okay. And P. Stay over there. Stay there. Stay there. Stay there. No. <laughs> you will not. You will not come in water. You will not. You stay away. You stay away from me. <sighs> no. Mm. He's still there. I really want to kill him because I want the pearls. Uh, uh, he's dead. Here we go. He's not dead. He's on fire. I think that's why he gets like all teleport crazy because he is. Um... Let's do the pee on this guy. <clears throat> Rain of fire. So I think once he gets caught, like set on fire, he go starts to go crazy. So I think that's why it's hard for me to kill them. Um. There's another fire, oh, here's a horse over here. There's another fire ogre over there. The fire ogre could have dropped a heart. I don't know what he's doing over here. He's supposed to only be in the nether. Let's go grab, see if he dropped a heart for us. No, he dropped some bones. Let's go over there. I wanna kill that guy. Oh, hello, little wolf. You're gonna die. And you're gonna die too, Mr. Ogre. Nope. Get back, get back. You too, Mr. Ghost. Get back. Get back. Okay. <clears throat> well, nobody dropped a heart for me. Having bad luck. We're having some bad luck with this, but we are we are leveling a lot. Um. Oh, I see. Um, I'm just gonna wait till the sun rises because some of the horses will burn too, and they might give me their uh, their hearts. So that might be good. So let's kill this horse over there. Just die. There's another mouse or another rat. Get, get, go away. Let's do this P move on them. Let's see. <laughs> I think I call it a P move. Well, there's not that many over there, so we'll just, we'll just kill them. Oh look, someone dropped fire. Get out of here, zombie. <clears throat> okay, so let me grab this fire. Did I not? Oh crap, we have like a full inventory. Dang. Okay, well, let's drop cobblestone because fire is pretty important. Um, oh, here's this plagiarism creeper. Plagiarism creeper, I hate you. Um, okay, so the sun will be rising pretty soon and I'm just gonna walk around and look for some hearts because we have some horses over in the distance. So hopefully. They'll drop some hearts for us. Did this guy drop a heart? No, this guy drops bones. He doesn't like giving me hearts. Oh, oh no, no, I didn't even see you. You give me heart. Is he dead? Die. No, he gave me leather. Okay, well, what the heck? Where are all of the hearts? I want to get them so that I can actually turn, um, 
We're gonna get rid of this one piece of coal so that I could turn my um, one of my wyverns into a give it an essence, make it like a crazy cool wyvern. <clears throat> um, all of these guys are gonna die. Let's let's try to kill these ones, and I'm gonna press P. Don't move over there. Okay, gotta make sure it's not coming down on me. Here we go. Let's go get that XP. Kill this wolf. Get out of here. Okay, did they give us any hearts? No, they're just giving us bones. And they didn't give me XP. What the heck? Lame. Okay, well, the sun is rising and animals are burning, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. I think I went a little over time, but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Be sure to check out the two links in the description. Um, but I'm gonna, I'm scared to like end it here because something's gonna attack me. Um, let's just do it right here. This seems like a good place, but um, thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys have an awesome remainder of your Sunday. I am Cupquake and I will see you all later. Bye.